I'm meteorologist Dave Warren with the forecast. Uh, well, the winter radar did look at a little bit of rain coming through the area. Uh, there was one solid area. Tried to see that snow mix in, but now let's push south. Not quite done yet. Uh, still a few showers being picked up moving through central PA. Uh, very light, very isolated and moving south as they move east. So there is still a chance we may see an isolated shower throughout the night tonight. And as it gets colder, it could come down in the form of snow, but really won't amount to much. Not much happening here. The close up view of the winter radar looking at a few showers passing by. Here's those uh, snow showers there west of Harrisburg, but they are moving east. Not much happening north of Philadelphia. If it does move through, it would be south of the city across Delaware and New Jersey. Might see a little snowflake coming down here uh, for the remainder of the evening. Good thing it's not up north because the temperatures are below freezing. That would cause some slick roadways, but not the case. Still above freezing and slowly dropping from Philadelphia to the south. So what to expect here the next few hours. If you do get any type of rain or snow, the temperature is still above freezing and does not drop down below freezing until 6, 7 o'clock tomorrow morning when everything's moved out. Uh, it may not even get down to freezing in Philadelphia, dropping down to about 34. Then with a little sunshine expected, more so in the afternoon, the temperature could climb. So if you're heading out in the morning, it's a little cool, but by the afternoon, we could be into the mid to upper 40s, not exactly warm, but it could be closer to 50 uh, there from Philadelphia to the south. 35 tomorrow morning by 8 o'clock. There will be clouds around in the morning and a little chill in the air. By the afternoon, though, in Philadelphia, sunshine expected with a few clouds. Suburbs, same thing, maybe just a little cooler, especially up to the north. The temperature will climb up to 48 degrees. It's just a little warmer than today. Satellite and radar looking at that rain moving out. Here are these isolated showers over West Virginia. You see as they move east, they push south and they break apart. So not much is expected overnight tonight. The future weather computer pushes it all south and clears us out by tomorrow morning. And that looks to be the trend here through Sunday and Monday. Might start to change though by the middle of the week. So a mix of rain or snow that will end. The clouds will linger overnight tonight. The wind will be about 10 to 15 miles an hour. 34 in the city, 27 north and west tomorrow 47 to 49 the skies will clear from north to south and we do get a little bit warmer by the afternoon and the seven day forecast has temperatures into the 50s monday and tuesday a few showers are possible wednesday as some colder air comes in and there it is by friday and saturday of next week lows into the 20s highs barely above 40.